There are four number of image file already put in the project file window. Okay, and the right hand side, right hand side is the preview window. This is called preview window. The center one is the property file window. The left hand side, sorry, center one is the project file. Left hand side the property. We have to arrange the photo into the track number five timeline. Okay. Then we can drag and drop into the track number 5 and then we can rearrange as per our requirement. Okay, which one we want the in front, which one we want on the back, then we can able to rearrange. Click full where we want, we can leave it there. Okay, then the first one, click on it, right click, go to transform click the transform and then right click again go to property and then go to the properties window find the scale x and scale y scale x change to 2.50 scale y change to 2.50 okay and then go to location x then you have to change the location x and the location y value also we have to change location x value we have to change to 0 0.30 ok see the person already on the right hand side move too, too much so change to 0 0.10 so now it's almost at the center of the window and y location y also will change to 0 0.10 so for the person face unable to see properly so we can uh, we can have to adjust again change to 0 0.1 0 0.05 0 point minus 0 0.5 so this one now become almost center see the zero there is a circle on the on the window preview window that is the center so we can control press right arrow key go to the end of the frame then I go to right click transform right click property and then go to scale x and scale y value also have to change again 1.20 scale x scale y same thing 1.20 and then go to location x this one we have to change to 0 0.00 location y also change to 0.00 okay and then now we have to press control and left arrow key in the keyboard then some go to the origin of the frame then we left split so we can see zoom out sorry zoom in zoom in the photo okay same thing go to the next one next photo Just click on the next photo frame and then control right Con press and hold the control key right arrow then right click on the one then transform then again right click property then go to the properties window same thing scale x scale y value we have to change 2.50 scale x scale y 2.50 okay and then go to location x we have to change as well 0 0.30 this one go to one side so we will change to 0 0.10 okay and still not so good we will change to 0 0.05 okay then location x we need to change to 0 point minus 0 0.05 okay so this port can able to see on the center of the video okay and then now still not so good we have to adjust again 0 0.00 
scale x change to 1.20 scale y change to 1.20 as well okay then after that click on the frame click on the frame control right, left hand arrow go to the beginning of the frame and then let's play you can see this and zoom out then these two photo frame we done the zoom out then another two zoom in click on the next video sorry click on the next photo control right arrow then go to the beginning of the this image then right click transform and go to the properties window x value change to 1.20 scale y change to 1.20 and then go to location x change to 0 0.00 location y change to 0 0.00 as well and then control press and hold the control key right arrow go to the end of the photo frame same thing go to the scale x change to 2.50 scale y change to 2.50 and then go to the location x change to 0 0.10 ok this one not good so change to 0 0.05 and then location y change to 0 0.05 Okay, now is center, center of the frame. Now change to 0 point, minus 0 point 0 0.05. So now it's become center. And then now control left arrow key, and then let's play. This is zooming out. This is zooming out. So now we can able to see under percent zooming out. Same thing goes to the next next match as well now we are done with all the photo frame now we have to arrange together make sure this snap tool is on when we all make it together always cannot connect properly you cannot get the continuity okay and then go to the player to the origin then let's play Okay, now we are done with our work. I hope this video helpful for somebody. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Two of them zoom in, two of them zoom out. Two of the photo frame zoom out, two of the photo frame zoom in. Thank you. Thank you for watching. I hope this video helpful for somebody. Thank you so much.